With this clock, let's first tell what time it is. Oh, Matt is saying it's about his supper time. Okay, you eat early. And then we will also tell the time five minutes later and half an hour later. So what time is it now? Besides being Matty's supper time, or close to it, we have five hours, right? And here's 15 and two more, so 17 minutes. Now five minutes later, that's easy. All you do is add to 17. 17 plus five is 22. Half an hour later, now half an hour means how many minutes? Yeah, 30 minutes. So you take 30 and add 17 and 30. 30 plus 17 is 47. And the hour does not change, since we didn't go more than 60. Now this one, what time is it here? Oh, Matt is saying it's his snack time. <laughs> okay, it's about 3 o'clock. Just a little bit past. Three minutes past three, or three oh three. Five minutes later, again you add three. Yeah, this is easy. Three oh eight. And half an hour later, not difficult. Add 30 minutes to that, so we get 333. Lots of threes. Lastly, we're gonna practice here changing these times to the hours, minutes, way. 12 till 4. It can help you if you have a practice clock. I'm gonna now point to the clock over there to help you. We have 12 minutes till 4. So if you look here, this would be 5 minutes till, 10 minutes till, and two little lines. It's this one here, okay? So in the hours and minutes way, this here would be 45 minutes. And three minutes more means 48, okay? So 48 minutes. And 12 till 4, it's not yet 4 o'clock. So the hours are 3. And the other way you can figure this out, this 12 and 48, is that there's 60 minutes in one hour. So if it is 12 minutes lacking from 4 o'clock, you can subtract 60 minus 12 is 48 minutes. Let's try another one. 22 minutes till 11 o'clock. Okay. I'm going to figure out the hours first. It's not yet 11, so it's 10 hours. 22 minutes till. Again, you could look at the clock here. Go 22 minutes backwards from here. 5, 10, 15, 20, and two more. It's this one here. So in the minutes, hours and minutes way, we have, we have 30 minutes, 35 plus 3, or 38 minutes. Or you can take 60 minutes minus 22 minutes, leaves you 38 minutes. 17 past 1. Mm -hmm. This one is easier, because it's not one of those till things, it's past. So it is one hour, and this tells you the minutes, one seventeen. Lastly, 19 till 6, one more of those till thingies. Till 6 hours. It's not yet 6 hours, so we write 5 here, 5 hours. And then let me subtract. It's 19 minutes lacking from the full 60 minutes. So 60 minus 19, it's almost 60 minus 20. That would be 40. But since it was just 19, then I have to add one minute to that. I'll get 41 minutes. Right, Matthew? Right. And? Aha, yeah, supper time. 19 till 6. No close to it. Okay, well done with this lesson.